What's up everybody? So I know I haven't vlogged in a little over a year, but it's my senior year and my birth month, so I figured I'd start vlogging again for the sake of memories. So if you're interested, just keep watching. So we are actually about to go out to Applebee's for dinner because it was my boyfriend's friend's 20th birthday yesterday. So we're gonna go there and just get some food and then probably head to the mall because I need to get a few things there. But this is my outfit of the day. Just a gray home t-shirt, a white bralette, some light wash jeans, my white Nikes, and my natural hair. Which I pretty much do every time I don't want to fix it because it looks good. It's just like beach waves. Then I got highlight, eyebrows, mascara, which is my pretty much natural like makeup routine every day anyway. I don't really go out unless I need to. He'll probably fall asleep on me. So I guess we're just gonna lay here because I can't move because he's here. So I guess we're just gonna lay here until Bill gets here. Plus, my phone is all the way on the other side of the room. All the way over there. Wow, it's not gonna focus, but it's all the way over there on my pile of clothes. That literally looks like human figures on the side. Does that not? Does that not? Oh, screw that. Yeah, I'm getting my floor. Um, get okay, so I walked over here, but no one's outside, so we're good on that. What's up, Dustin? <laughs> So my camera died yesterday at the dinner, so I didn't get to record anymore, obviously. But I'm at school right now, so I'll just fill you in on what happened after my camera died later when I sit down and record. But I'm just going to make this a two-day vlog because I didn't have enough footage to make it one. So... Okay, so I am now leaving school, but I'm on my way to Hickory because I have an eye doctor's appointment. But hold on. One oh one. One oh one. Thank you. You're welcome. Anyway, so I have an eye doctor's appointment at 320, but I was thinking I could go to Sweet Frog to see if um I can get a job there because I need another job because I don't work as much as my one now. And I applied a few like months ago and just never went back. So I think I'm gonna go back today before I go to my eye appointment. I need to get some gas too. So, right, anyway, let me tell you what happened yesterday after my camera died. Okay, so we were eating at Applebee's for Dustin's 20th birthday. And I saw an ambulance like pulling into the parking lot and I didn't know what it was. I was like, why is there an ambulance here? And the waitress lady, she came up to me and said, some guy drunk too much and just passed out over there in a booth. And she said, if you stand up and walk around, you'll be able to see him. So I stood up and I walked around and this like 40 year old man was passed out drunk in a booth and wouldn't wake up. So the paramedics had to come in and like get him up and take him out and find him a way home. I have a, I'll put a clip right here to show you what happened. But then, um, after the paramedics left, we sang for Dustin's birthday, but I tried to record a little bit of that, but my camera also died then, and I'll put the footage here. Now, I'm going to Hickory. I need to get my nails done, actually. Because my nails have natural nails have grown really really long 
underneath my acrylics. You probably won't be able to tell by the camera, but they are so long underneath. Like they're almost as long as my acrylics. So I'm just gonna take those off and get Joe on sometime this week or for my birthday, because I should be getting birthday money pretty soon. So I'm turning 18, that's like a big deal. But yeah, school was fine. I dressed up in leggings and a sweatshirt in my Burks. No makeup, just mascara. That's it. Like, I don't have my eyebrows done or anything. Natural hair, I did not care today. I woke up and my throat hurt so bad. I felt so sick. So I was like, I was gonna dress up. Like, I was gonna look nice and straighten my hair and do everything, but I was not feeling it this morning. So I did not. So I've made it to Hickory. It took me about like 10 minutes-ish. And I think I'm gonna go get gas first. I just passed a gas station, but it was 270 something and I'm not having that. So I'm gonna go down to a little bit farther one that I hope will be cheaper. It normally is, so that's where I'm gonna go. And then I think I'm gonna get me a strawberry lemonade from Wendy's, which it literally is the best drink. Like if you haven't tried a strawberry lemonade from Wendy's, do it. Like no regrets, just do it. You won't regret it, it's so good. And then it'll probably be around two-ish when I get done with that. So then I'll probably go to my eye appointment early and see if they can take me back a little bit early. Or I might go to Sweet Frog, like I said. Not too sure what I'm gonna do yet. Little bit of traffic here today in Hickory. Oh. Okay, so that was awkward. When I pulled up to the light, I was re gonna record the traffic and some old couple like pulled up and stared at me like right when I was talking to myself to a camera. It's literally a cent cheaper than what the other one was. I just drove over a mile for nothing. Currently calling my mom because I'm having a crisis and she's not gonna answer. Oh my God. Oh my gosh, so Joel has my debit card and I can't get gas because I don't have my debit card and I literally have one mile till empty, like no joke. One mile till empty. And I still have to go to the eye doctor and I'm not gonna be able to make it there. And I don't have my debit card. Joel works all the way in Eichard and I'm all the way in Hickory, so. Oh, panic attack, panic attack. Currently sitting here trying to call my mom because BB&T is closed and they don't use my license to take money out. I have to have my debit card and I don't have my debit card and I don't know what to do because no one can bring me money and I'm stressing out. So that's good. And I have zero miles till empty now. So I don't know how I'm gonna get anywhere. Also, it's getting really freaking hot in here. I'm on a sweatshirt and leggings and a hot car because I can't turn, that's too loud, because I can't turn on my air conditioning because I have zero miles still empty and it'll use up all my gas, so. This is just a lose-lose situation right now. At least I have a pretty view of Academy and Pi 5. I'm currently just parked at the bank by myself because they're closed. So I'm just sitting here alone, just chilling, waiting on my mom to call me back because I gotta get money somehow to get gas because I don't have any. I should have realized I didn't have my debit card, but I didn't. So I guess my dad couldn't leave because my mom's on her way to meet me right now. And I still have zero miles till empty, but I have to try to make it to a gas station because if I don't, then I'm screwed. So I gotta get through this traffic, go back down the road and go to the gas station, hopefully before I completely run out of gas. Cause you can always drive a little bit more when you're, like you can always keep going when you're on zero. Wow, I was totally just in the wrong line of traffic. I don't know if I was supposed to do that, but now I'm heading back to Sheets to meet my mom to get gas, so 
Okay, so I made it to the gas station, the sheets that I was at before. So I'm just here, sitting here, waiting on my mom, just watching YouTube. Haley Barber, I think that's how you pronounce her last name. She's really good, I really do recommend her. But I'm just sitting here waiting for my mom to get here. Normally, like, if you're waiting to get gas, you'll park with some bud behind somebody who's already getting gas so you know that you get the next spot. But I really hope no one does that to me because I'm just going to sit here and wait on my mom. So. My mom has arrived 30 minutes later. She's finally here. And I um, tore off two of my nails. Finally getting gas. I know my natural nails will break if I don't go get them done right now. So she's gonna give me money to go get them done and I'm gonna go pick up my paycheck and pay her back tomorrow because it's Columbus Day and the bank's not open. So. Okay, so after my mom got me gas, I started to take the gas pump out of my car and the gas just started leaking everywhere, all over my car. So I had to clean it off and gas can take off paint if you leave it on your car. When I pulled away just now, there was a man up at the tank like with a key trying to unlock it. I guess it wasn't supposed to do that, but it did. And now my car smells like gas. So. Hands down, strawberry lemonade is the best drink ever. And if you go and you do get one, ask for light ice because they'll put too much and then it makes it too watery because you, I like to drink mine slow to like savor the taste. And if they put too much ice, then it'll just get it watery too fast. But it is the best drink. Now I'm just sitting in my eye doctor's parking lot eating a crispy chicken sandwich from Wendy's. Drinking my strawberry lemonade. It's literally the best drink ever. Like, there's like nothing you, like you can't go wrong with one of these. doctors and my eyes actually got worse so they had to change my prescription to a different power which is good but they gave me the some blink tears eye drops and contact solution because my eyes get really dry so now I'm gonna go to bliss nails to get my nails done because I've pulled every single one of those fingers off and these two and I know they're gonna break if I don't get them done so I'm gonna go get them done right now and then probably head to the house and clean and organize my closet. I'm just gonna end the vlog there today but I went and got my nails done and she cut them down too short and they're pink but it's whatever so I'll just see you guys when I vlog again.